I'm Jamie Dupree in Washington. Reporters on Air Force One were told this afternoon that at this point, the U.S. is still trying to figure out exactly what group was behind the attacks in Paris. I say he's a great journalist because no one can ever figure out if he has an opinion on a story. The reason Jamie thinks it's so important to be neutral is that it doesn't matter who's in office, it doesn't matter who's in power. Whatever's going on in Washington is a story that needs to be told. He's always on and he's always in the hunt for the story. And um, that's the mark of, a, of an old school news guy. John Kasich likely staying away from that. This will be the smallest debate yet. Only four Republicans on stage. Of uh, note, Megyn Kelly, one of the most... I distinctly remember the last night he was able to be with us there as that 2016 campaign raged on. It was the night of the Indiana primary. Not long after that, his voice was gone. It was just absolutely gone. It's never come back. And he saw everybody. I mean, he went to Johns Hopkins, he went to Mayo, and nobody could put a finger on why it was that he couldn't speak until he finally got a doctor who, who gave him the, the diagnosis of the, the dystonia, where something's firing in his brain that would tell his mouth to move and speak but something's not making the right connection with him, and so he can't make words the way we all make words, and it has been just devastating. I was thinking about Jamie, and I was thinking about how there must be a way to create a customized voice. There are a bunch of companies out there who do um, voice synthesis. And Mike Lupo over at Corporate found this little company in Scotland called Sarah Proc, and they create voices. And we sent Sarah Proc 250, 300 samples of what Jamie sounded like when he was creating a report. And from that, they were able to recreate his voice. Jamie Dupree 2.0. The U.S. Supreme Court has basically punted on the issue of legislative gerrymandering, avoiding major rulings in a pair of cases, one from Wisconsin and one from Maryland. We have 82 degrees on Peachtree Street, hot and muggy. The president said he would issue immigration changes next week in an executive order, but left many details unclear on what exactly the White House would do. Mr. Speaker, Jamie Dupree is an example for every American who has been afflicted with disease. Tenacious, intelligent, determined. He is a credit to his esteemed and essential profession, the media, and to his organization, the Cox Media Group. Way to go, Jamie Dupree. We're all with you, buddy.